Ladies and gentlemen, this amateur bantamweight battle is, brought, is scheduled for three three-minute rounds and it's brought to you by our friends at Spectation Sport. And now, introducing first, she's fighting out of the blue corner. She steps into the cage tonight with a record of zero wins, looking to redeem one loss. Her height, five feet, four inches, and her weight, 135 pounds. She trains with Cook's Impact, and she fights out of Powder Springs, Georgia. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you, Bailey. Across the cage and fighting out of the red corner. She stepped into the cage tonight at a height of five feet three inches, weighing in at 135 pounds. She trains with London martial arts and she fights out of London, Kentucky. And tonight in the Aries Fight Series cage, she Kennedy, Hunley, Bailey, Flattery. Amazing bantamweight action here tonight. Yeah, this is, uh, this is my first look at Hunley, and I was so impressed with Flaherty uh, in her first contest tonight. Oh, man, I knew we were going to see some good striking here. We're in for a good Kennedy one. Kennedy, Hunley. Oh, man. Bailey a little bit more hesitant on these uh, on throwing these arms and throwing her strikes. Good jab utilization for uh, Hunley, but yep. this is where you didn't want to be against Flaherty. Nope. Oh man, you see Hunley trying to set up this triangle here. Very smart. Good frame here. Nothing coming easy for either fighter, but it is a Flaherty enjoying the top control at the moment over the Atomic Blonde. Got to be careful here yep, the arm bar. Here, yep. How many times do you see oh, it? Oh, man, that is baited in pretty good, and that's a good angle for her. She can get that extension. She might have it. Flaherty does not seem harmed by that at all. I love the knees to the body to try and escape. She should keep it going because that is a, that arm is in danger. Flaherty trying to ignore it, and it's just hard to see from here if she's got the angle or for the positioning. She's got the positioning here. Man, Flaherty, the warrior, yeah, Flaherty doing out. a good job bending that arm and not letting her straighten that out. I, I'll tell you what, that's what I love about the women's contests. The flexibility there to be able to throw knees to the person yeah. trying to arm bar. You don't see that in a, in a men's contest. No. Oh, Flaherty's got the back here of Kenny Hundley going to be hard with her back against the cage here, see if she can make something happen out of it. Hunley's just got to defend uh, her back effectively here for another minute, 10 seconds in round three. Is there an opportunity here for Hunley to turn in and maybe get on top? There could be as she's doing, trying to attempt to do that right now. Oh, Flattery advancing her position here. Flattery knows what she's doing on the ground. That's the thing. Yep. The, it's, it's very hard for us to see. I cannot tell if there's a, a I don't think she has. Squeeze. No, I don't think she has quite the angle on it yet. It's not good optics, though, for what uh, what you would want to see yeah, there. For Harlan's Hunley. not going to let Hunley's this go on too much further. She's covering up 30 seconds remaining here in the first. Hunley's in a bad way right now. She is. 20 seconds needed to survive round one if you're Hunley. And in your debut, you know, for MMA, this... This round just has to feel like it went by in an instant. Yep. I thought we were going to see an opportunity there for for Bailey to set up an arm bar. 
return the favor. We're going to make it here in the second. Flaherty looks so comfortable on the ground. I, I think when round two begins. Uh, She's going to be looking to take that fight. Yeah, got, that, that, that worked so good, and, and it really was effective. Yep. If you're in the corner of Hunley right now, you've got to be shaking out, uh, you know, the jitters. That was a tough first round. You're definitely up against it at the moment. But you got to listen to the Cook's Impact corner there. Let those guys coach you up, settle you down, get your breathing back about you. Because yeah. in all likelihood, um, ex excuse me, let the London Martial Arts corner. I'm so sorry. Um, but you got to let your corner calm you down. You got to take the moment in and put that round one behind you. Yeah. This is a reset on the fight. And if you're Flaherty, you got to be feeling pretty good. That was a very uh, dominant round. Yeah, I think that's exactly what they wanted to see here from Cook to Impact. Well, Hunley felt Flaherty's power on the ground, and it's definitely going to be priority number one to stay on your feet here in round two. Give me a deep breath, Flaherty. Deep breath. That's a girl. A lot of girls. There she comes, Flaherty. Kennedy Hudley's going to do what she can to keep this fight on the on the toes. Yeah, I think Kennedy wants to get down to work, too. Yep. She'd rather be the hammer than the nail. Nice right hand. I'd like to see a little bit more uh, strength and purpose put behind Bailey Flattery's kicks. She's putting them out there, but just not with a lot of impact. There was strength and purpose on a nice right hand from Hundley there that landed a moment ago. Another. And the crowd is, is responding every time she lands. Ooh. Another separate if you're Hunley. That is the, that is crucial. Oh, a great takedown. Clarity so smart with that head throw. Yep. Houston, she might have a scarf choke. What do you think? Possibly, but Hunley, what she's trying to do is push her from the other side, and she is a little heavy over her head. It could work, but she needs to be pushed in the opposite direction. She's got a good job getting her hips on her. Now she needs to push. Push her over. Yeah, that technique made famous by Alexi Olenek. He was so proficient with it. Yep. And the more you struggle to get away from it, the tighter it got. Oh, this is yeah, dangerous now. That's this could is, be uh, the beginning of the end here. If Bailey can secure that arm, not much defending here. Harlan's taking a hard look at this. Yeah, Hunley cannot allow that arm to be compromised. Oh, and there it is. The corner of Flaherty telling their fighter that she is in the torture zone, and that's how I would describe this. Yeah, Harlan's going to call this Flaherty quick. is torturing her. I mean, that's, that's a lot of strikes. And that's going to do it. Accumulation of strikes. That is a big first win. For Bailey Flaherty, and a tough lesson to learn for the debuting MMA debut of Kennedy Hunley Houston. Yep. Cook's impact with uh, a lot of reason to celebrate. Bailey Flaherty looked great, and we'll take a look at the fight ending sequence, Houston. Yeah, I'd love to see that takedown again, but she did a great job pinning that arm and securing that and, and doing what she needed to do and taking very minimal damage coming out of this. So I think that. Bailey Flattery is going to be ready for her next fight, hopefully very soon. Undercard saw a fair amount of decisions, maybe a little more than we're used to. Main card, though, two fights, two finishes. This yep. one coming in round two. Bailey Flaherty in her second MMA bout gets her first MMA victory. A great contest. We throw it out to Lance Green to make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, one minute and 50 seconds into round number two. Your referee, Harlan Bolton, has brought a stop to this match. Your winner, by way of TKO, and with her first...